Hello everyone, thank you so much for watching today's video. In this video I'm gonna show you a quick everyday eye makeup look that you can wear for work or for school or any occasion you want to wear it for. And also in this video I'm gonna use only drugstore affordable makeup products. So I'm gonna link all the products I'm using today in the description bar. And the palette I'm gonna start with is this new palette which is by Essence Cosmetics. It's called the Bronze This Way. Um, so I felt like this would be the perfect palette to use for today since it has kind of like neutral tones. So I started with the super light color, which I only use to kind of like set my whole eyelid in place. I first always prime my eyelid and I just wanted to blend a little bit of this in my crease to make sure that my eyeshadow primer was locked in place. Uh, in my especially like in my crease area sometimes when you first go in with a light color all the other eyeshadows you're gonna blend out afterwards are gonna gonna blend out more easily if that makes sense because there's already like a soft layer of eyeshadow on your eyelid so the other eyeshadows are gonna kind of glide on more easily if that makes sense so now I went in with this kind of warm orangey brown color. I'm just gonna blend this all in my crease. I'm gonna keep it very simple today with this eye look. So I'm only gonna use this like as my base transition shade. And then I'm, after this, I'm gonna use a color all over the eyelid. And that's all I'm gonna do on my eyelid basically. But I really wanted to make sure that I blended as much as possible of this shade. So I'm just gonna go back in with my brush kind of going forward making circular motions going from all the way to the inner corner to the outer corner making sure that this shade is everywhere so this is a really warm brown color and colors like this really make your eye color stand out more especially if you have blue eyes like me or green eyes but it will also look really beautiful on brown eyes especially if you have some warmth in your eyes it's gonna stand out even more so i think this eye look will actually suit with any eye color so that's really nice. So of course, everything I'm doing at one side, I'm also doing at the other side of my eye. And then I went in with a flat diviner brush and I decided to use that same color and apply this underneath the lower lash line as well. So kind of pressing it and sweeping my brush back and forth, just making sure that the shade is all the way applied like underneath the lower lash line area. Then after applying the eyeshadow, I went in with that same color using a tiny blending brush and blending my brush back and forth just to make everything more softly blended out but because with the other shade i just kind of applied it and with this soft brush i kind of want to smoke it out and make it look more softer around the edges you can apply as much as you want um i went for quite a lot <laughs> because i really like that blown out effect so now i'm using my finger to apply this golden shade Pigmentation is beautiful. Um, I have been using a lot of Essence products lately because I also make content for their YouTube channel. And I'm just really surprised with how good the quality is. Like their makeup is so inexpensive, but it's definitely worth getting it, especially if you don't have a lot of money to spend on makeup. I would definitely recommend to check out their makeup. I feel like it keeps getting better and better. So I went in with this kind of like soft golden pencil for in the wad line. It's a really soft pencil. It does not have like a lot of color payoff, but I actually like that because it just gives that really soft golden sheen in your wad line instead of like super intense. So now I use the Essence Lash Curler to curl my lashes. And for my mascara, I'm gonna use a mascara from Maybelline, which is my favorite drugstore mascara. I have been raving about this mascara so many times, but honestly, I think you guys are gonna love it. I don't think it doesn't really matter what kind of lashes you have. Everyone that I've spoken to loves this mascara and I would highly recommend it. Um, I'm definitely gonna buy a new one because I just want to continue using it <laughs> so yeah after applying the mascara i did not go in with fake lashes i'm gonna keep it this way to keep it really easy and nice for work or school so yeah this is the finished result i really hope you all enjoyed this video let me know what kind of drugstore tutorial i should film next and yeah just hope you all enjoyed don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy that's really helpful for my youtube channel and hopefully i will see you all in the next one Bye guys!